Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Med Pharmaco Essentials. So in this video, I have come up with the topic storage recommendation and use of oral antibiotic suspensions. Usually most of the pediatric patient will be prescribed with this oral antibiotic suspensions. So how to use it, how much is the shelf life of that, everything we will be covering in this video. Storage is important in order to maintain the medication's effectiveness and stability. Usually a syrup that is antibiotic oral suspensions after reconstitution that is nothing but mixing of that powder or granule with the water can be stored from 7 to 14 days. Okay, it has a lifespan of 5 days also. So, you have to be very careful after a uh, while reconstitution. Suppose the doctor has prescribed you a uh, oral uh, antibiotic suspension. So, once you reconstitute it, you can use it for 7 days. If their uh, prescription is for 14 days, so reconstitute the next bottle after the 7 days. Okay, so that you can maintain the effectiveness as well as stability of that oral suspensions see some of the storage recommendation and expiry dates of some of um, oral antibiotic suspensions first is amoxicillin oral solution for children after reconstituting it that is mixing it with the water you can refrigerate it under 2 degrees celsius to 8 degrees celsius and use it for 7 days mm, uh, some of them have even sugar free versions will be available that you can use it for 14 days Next is co amoxiclav liquid antibiotic for children. It is nothing but combination of uh, amoxicillin and clavulonic acid. So after reconstituting it, you can refrigerate it from uh, in the two to eight degrees Celsius, and you can use it for seven days. Next is uh, flucloxacillin, a uh, oral solution for children. It is also after preparation, that is reconstitution, you can keep it in the fridge and use it for seven days. days. Next is cephalexin oral suspension. So it is available in two different strengths you can see here. After reconstitution, you can store it for 2 to 8 degrees Celsius and even at the cooler uh, temperature that is 6 to 15 degrees Celsius. Yes. Its uh, shelf life is 14 days. Next is azithromycin suspensions. So here it is available in powder form also. Uh, this after reconstitution, you can keep it at the room temperature but do not exceed about 25 degrees Celsius form of azithromycin that is 200 mg per 5 ml oral suspension has a shelf life of 10 days but one mixed with uh, zithromax uh, suspension has a shelf life of 5 days next we will discuss some of the erythromycin liquid antibiotic for children Different strength have different storage condition. For example, 125 mg per 5 ml, 250 mg per 5 ml, 500 mg per 5 ml sugar free. Now, once they are reconstituted, they have to be stored in 2 degrees Celsius to 8 degrees Celsius. Some of the sugar free versions do not have a specific storage recommendation, they have to be stored in the room temperature. Next, erythromycin 125 mg per 5 ml, 250 mg per 5 ml, 500 mg per 5 ml with sugar if they are made then once made up uh, you have to keep it under the cool place or fridge uh, usually 15 degrees celsius and it has a lifespan of 14 days. Actually, I have seen many patients using this oral suspensions for many days, that is for two to three weeks also they are using it. They don't have the knowledge that it should be, the, these antibiotic oral suspensions can be used for seven days. It should be stored in two to eight degrees Celsius or some are stored in room temperatures. So as a healthcare professional, we have to guide them and instruct them of, of all these conditions. Thanks for watching the video. Please like, share the video and subscribe the channel. Thank you.